What is disease X? It has been designated by the World Health Organization as a serious international epidemic could be caused by a pathogen currently unknown to cause human disease. Essentially, disease X is any pathogen currently known or unknown that has the virulence factors necessary to create a worldwide epidemic. Virulence factors are the characteristics of a specific pathogen that make it deadlier and more efficient at transmission, infection, and resistance to immune mechanisms. The more virulence factors a pathogen has, the higher biosafety CDC level it will be given. Disease X possible characteristics. As a designation only, disease X does not have its own morphology or cellular characteristics. We would not know the specifics of how it could invade cells, evade the immune system, signs and symptoms, or the curative or therapeutic interventions needed. However, based on the designation by the WHO as its possible use as a bioweapon or simply its ability to cause widespread epidemics, it would most likely mimic these deadly diseases. Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome, SARS. The illness spread to more than two dozen countries in North America, South America, Europe, and Asia before the SARS global outbreak of 2003 was contained. It is spread via droplets when an infected person coughs or sneezes. The virus can also spread when a person touches a surface or object contaminated with infectious droplets. Middle Eastern Respiratory Syndrome, or MERS. About three to four out of every 10 people reported with MERS have died. It's thought to be spread through close contact or droplets, although the precise ways the virus spreads are not currently well understood. There is no specific antiviral treatment recommended for MERS. Individuals with MERS often receive medical care to help relieve symptoms. For severe cases, current treatment includes care to support vital organ functions. Ebola virus. The virus is transmitted to people from wild animals and spreads in the human population through human to human transmission. The average fatality rate is around 50%. Case fatality rates have varied from 25 to 90% in the past outbreaks. First symptoms are the sudden onset of fever, fatigue, muscle pain, headache, and sore throat. This is followed by vomiting, diarrhea, rash, symptoms of impaired kidney and liver function, and in some cases, both internal and external bleeding. Anthrax. Anthrax is a serious infectious disease caused by gram-positive rod-shaped bacteria known as Bacillus anthracis. It is spread through spores and three types with altering types of mortality, cutaneous inhalation and gastrointestinal. While not contagious, it has been designated as a tier one agent and highly likely to be used as a bioweapon since the microscopic spores could be put into powders, sprays, food, and water.
why is disease X important? The World Health Organization and the CDC have established the idea of disease X as the designation for any dis disease that might cause a worldwide or widespread epidemic. The specific contingency that arises with disease X may vary depending on the transmission and mortality rates, methods of dispersion as in a biochemical attack or surfacing of a previously unknown disease. The designation of disease X is important because it allows for the planning of any future epidemics. From a microbiology outlook, we can predict that the patterns of unknown diseases from the study or etiology or epidemiology of the diseases we currently understand. This allows for faster examination, safer handling, isolation, and ultimately treatment of the disease.